Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Laura and welcome to my channel. Today is day 6 of Face Masktober and we are going to be testing out Beauty Concepts Hydrating with Rose Hip Face Mask. And it's a sheet mask. It says, promotes radiant skin, revitalizes skin's texture and appearance, nourishes and moisturizes. And let me read the instructions here. Our facial treatment masks are formulated for an at-home spa result. Cleanse face and remove any makeup. Done. Open mask and gently place on clean, dry skin. Wear mask for 20 minutes and relax as your skin is nourished and revitalized. Remove mask. Remove mask. Rinse skin clean and enjoy youth, youthful, radiant skin. Let's go ahead and get this one done. And this is one that I bought in a packet from TJ Maxx. It came with like four different masks, I believe. So you will be seeing the other three as well. Feels like a nice thick mask. We should make a drinking game out of this series. How many times I say mask, you have to take a drink. I gotta be honest, I really don't like these ones where they don't cut the eye holes out. It is super duper windy today in North Dakota. So, and the window's like right behind you guys. So, hopefully you can't hear that. tell you right now that it is very floral scented. And I have it on cooking. There. Now at if any point this starts to burn, I will be taking it off early. I'm just going to see if there is any more juice in here. Not really, I don't really get any. So I'll just put what I need to get on my neck. And my phone is actually in the other room charging, so I'm gonna go ahead and shut the camera off and go set my phone for 20 minutes, and we will be back after it's done. Okay, so we're back. It's been 20 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and remove the mask. And thankfully, it did not burn, so I didn't have to worry about that. And I do feel hydrated. So it says hydrating with rosehip oil promotes radiant skin, revitalizes skin texture and appearance, nourish, nourishes and moisturizes. So I do feel that my face is moisturized. Um, I do look radiant. I'm forgetting. We have to go actually wash this off, don't we? Yeah, run skin clean. So I'll be right back. I'm going to go run Okay, so I'm back again. I just splashed some water on my face, um, some lukewarm water on my face, and just kind of like did one of these things. I didn't actually like, why am I saying like a lot? I didn't actually wash my face, but I rinsed it clean because it doesn't say to clean your face like a soap or anything like that. But I still do feel moisturized and I do feel radiant. Like you can kind of see how my skin is kind of glowing right there. Especially around my nose and my cheeks, chin, forehead. So yeah, this was actually a pretty decent mask. I was scared there at the beginning that it might burn because I'm exfoliating my skin, but it it kind of had a, like a little bit of a sensation in the beginning, but it wasn't like painful or anything like that. I just was starting to get scared that uh, it might burn, but it never did burn. So. Yeah, pretty good mask. Um, like I said, I picked this up at TJ Maxx in a pack of four. So there are three other different ones that I will be 
reviewing as well throughout Face Mask Tober. So if you have tried one of these yet from TJ Maxx by the Beauty Concepts or if you're going to go pick them up, please comment down below. Please thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so now that way you don't miss out on my future videos. And until tomorrow's next Face Mask Tober video, I hope you're having a great day, night, weekend, wherever you are, whatever you're doing. Bye everybody. It really helps when you film these videos a little bit earlier than really late at night when you have no energy. Just a tip.